Welcome back, and today we've got a great update for Skywater Technology SKYT. Last time we covered Skywater was March 17th of 2025 at a tender price of $8.46 a share. So remember, Skywater Technology is a U.S. pure play foundry. Uh, this is a critical semiconductor uh, technology company, part of the U.S. reindustrialization efforts. Uh, and specializing in technology as a service, serving the Department of Defense, Aerospace, Automotive, Biomedical, Industrial, and the Quantum Sectors. Skywater Technology touches a lot of sectors. And as a service, so this means that, that the companies that they partner with to make their technical or semiconductor products are often contributing good amounts of money to to set up the fabrication, the equipment, and get it and get it rolling. So it's truly a unique structure and collaboration, and it seems to be working for Skywater. So what events have occurred since we last spoke about, about Skywater? Its price has moved up nicely since we last talked. But remember, this is a trusted U.S. government uh, collaborator, and they just closed on a large acquisition uh, that was announced earlier in the year, and this was Fab 25, purchased from Infineon Semiconductor. Uh, so this expands the company tremendously, adds a lot of revenue, adds a lot of growth, and a lot of capabilities as Skywater will roll out all of their products to all the companies that they work with and more to come onto this platform. So this is truly a, a, a large acquisition. They were able to uh, close it very nicely and there's gonna be a lot of big things that, that come from that. So as we've indicated earlier in this conversation, this is a trusted government supplier, as well as a supplier to many solid companies that are, that are growing by leaps and bounds. But it's because they have that rad hard manufacturing uh, and def Department of Defense accredit accreditations, uh, they are likely also to play a role in the Golden Dome Project. So this will be a key catalyst for them going forward as well. This is a pure play semiconductor foundry, and we know where things are headed, at least in the United States, and this company is squarely right in the middle of those efforts. Uh, let's take a look at the fundamentals and see where that shakes out for us. So Skywater Technology, a company with a market cap of about $493 million. This is a small cap play, with ambitions to get much larger. Trading at right now at a tender price of about $10.25 uh, per share. It's made a nice rebound since those, since those March and uh, April lows. In the past year, this company has seen its share price between $5.63 a share and all the way up to $19 a share. So we're still at the lower end of that range. And there's a lot of exciting things coming that we've, that we've talked about and some more to come. Uh, this company, again, was trading at $34 a share just in early 2022. So it's down with the rest of the semiconductor space. It's down quite a bit. And, and that means there's a lot of room to, to make a come, to strongly come back and set new highs in, in the future. Year to date, down about 26%. Over the five years, it's down 34%. So that means that there's, there's good, again, I'm gonna say there's good room you're getting in now, if you like the company, you're getting in now at a, at a good uh, price uh, target or price range with, with targets um, pretty stable and probably going to move up quite dramatically. So what's it look like from a revenue perspective? Did about $340 million in revenue in 2024. That's going to go up to probably over $500 million in 2025 with this very large FAB25 acquisition. Uh, it's EBITDA positive and strong, good balance sheet with cash with cash and debt. Uh, this play, this company is in a sweet spot right now. Analysts are are seeing this with only an eleven to twelve dollar price per share target, not much above where it's currently at. However, I believe that this company will be headed substantially higher as soon as things uh, the, the economy starts clicking a little bit, as many companies in the semi space have have sold off. Uh, quite a bit. Uh, the interesting thing is there's there's nothing but strong buys out there for Skywater Technology, yet the revisions to the share price have not come up. So here's some catalyst for much higher share price to move forward. 
is that we've got uh, an earnings date of August 6th that's coming up. I'm expecting that's their Q2 2025 earnings. I'm, I'm looking for an upbeat market analysis from the company uh, on the, the merger, on the, on the progress, and kind of the, the next steps uh, for the rest of the year. Potentially more M&A is on the way would be another catalyst. They are going to get a significant revenue boost and, uh, and cash flow will increase quite nicely from this FAB25 uh, acquisition as, as well. So remember, for a company that's into photonics, quantum chips, medical chips or biomedical chips, defense uh, oriented, and just overall US, uh, US player in the uh, pure play in the semiconductor space, this is growing into a very critical player in the U.S. semiconductor chain, uh, ecosystem, and supply chain. I'm looking for a lot of uh, upward momentum in this company from now through the end of the year, and have been increasing my position accordingly. Let me know if you if you are on board with Skywater, what you're doing, or if this has tweaked or piqued your interest in it, and you're going to take a closer look. Uh, hope this helps, and we'll talk again real soon.